yeah, we fully are. Right, guys, welcome back to the Carmel Show. It's your girl, Christina Carmel. And like I've been saying to you for the last week or so, we've got a special guest in the building. Do you want to introduce yourself or should I do it? Uh, let's do it together. <laughs> right, after three. So, wow. ladies and gentlemen, my special guest today is... Um, <laughs> 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 it is... Chris Beats. The I'm actually <laughs> the drama boy is in the building, guys. Thank you. I'm so excited. So remember, guys, if you want to stream live, you can do that via the website at www.tgmradiouk.com or via Facebook. And you can find us also on social media. Mine is at Christina Carmel, and that is everywhere. What about you? That's Chris Beats underscore. And is that everywhere? everywhere lovely 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 now we're gonna get into the interview i've got some juicy questions for him but we're gonna play some music first because we need to get into the vibe so we're gonna get into some music first and then we're gonna have a little bit of a chit chat you ready I'm ready Right, guys, and we are back, and welcome to the Carmel Show. If you're not locked in, make sure you lock in via the website at www.tgemradiouk. And like I said, we've got a special guest in that building. I'm so excited. How are you feeling? I'm good, my G. How are you doing? I'm all right, my G. So how are you? <laughs> <laughs> how are you, my G? So how are you finding London? Good, good, good. You know, um, beautiful people, amazing people. You know, I don't feel like I'm in London. I feel like I'm in Lagos. You know, so do you? Yeah. Why is there like a similarity? Yeah, and the people, you know, I have my friends, my families, and stuff. Yeah. Oh really? So, yeah. what, how how many times have you been here? Um, this is the sec- This is my second time. Oh wow! Yeah. So you like new new? Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> okay, so we're gonna get right into it. So tell us a bit about how you got started, and kind of why music. Oh, uh, I I've always wanted to do music from like as far as i can remember you know yeah. so but uh my mom won't let you drop out of school to do music so i <laughs> <laughs> typical african yeah african so i i went to i studied linguistics in the university of ibadan in nigeria yeah and i did my master's in south africa south africa yeah. oh you okay I, uh, <laughs> okay <laughs> Girl, <been> doing that <laughs> work. <laughs> okay yeah so started from there okay yeah. okay so what is so i heard like obviously you grew up in a single parent household yeah, yes so I how did. how did you find that uh you know uh my mom had to switch from being mom to mom and dad yeah of you course. know so it didn't it didn't i feel maybe sometimes you know it affects the way i you know relate with people because sometimes you know i might be all gangster and stuff you know but oh. <laughs> sometimes <Really? laughs> i'm that's you know that meek, that meek person who like wants to care for everybody, and yeah. I feel that has a lot to do with more what my mom has done for me. So, have yeah. you been back to South Africa since you finished studying? Yes, definitely. Really, I've been going there all the time on, until recently. <laughs> <laughs> do, you like, do, you, do you enjoy being there? Yes, I do. To okay. be honest, yeah. It's, have you been there? No, I want to go. You know, oh, I yeah, really, really want to go. It's, it's very beautiful. I had the people like. But I'm you've so been to nice. Lagos? No. Oh. Listen, the only place I go to is home, which is Ghana. I don't go anywhere else. Oh, no, you no should. but I want to go to Nigeria. You should it's come to on Nigeria. the list to you go should. soon. You should. Yes, I'll definitely go now that you've told me. I'll definitely go. <laughs> you can give me all the hotspots to go to. Of course. <laughs> so, <laughs> so I was listening to uh, an interview you did, and you were saying you were referring to yourself as a music architect. Yeah. Um, what did you mean by that? Oh, okay. It's a term. Yeah. I am a sound designer. Okay. A sound designer is someone who makes sound with anything. I could like pick this wire and just make a sound. Yeah. Who, who creates sound? I don't just go pick people's sound and use them. You get me? Yeah. So I just I uh, that's a sound architect. Someone who designs sound. From you scratch. Know? Yeah, from scratch. Someone who who I did music technology, so I can tell what i can tell okay how how many db of noise we have in this room just oh, by wow. listening do you understand so yeah do you feel like a lot of of like a lot of music nowadays yeah. has that like raw freshness or is it just all just the same no i mean you don't need you don't need to know all that to make good music if that's what you're saying do you yeah. Understand? <laughs> yeah that's what i'm saying today. yeah subliminal way <laughs> So that's yeah. you don't you don't need those things to make good music. You need good ears. 
to be able to know you know what to say what to do and when to do it okay yeah. okay that's that's very 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 interesting so do you so let me ask you this then why do you think a lot of people now want to do afro beats i mean what is there it, about it's, it? It started from Africa, so yes. it should, it should, it's, it's only right, it's only right for you to go back to Africa. You know what I mean? Yeah. yeah. So if everybody wants to write on Afrobeat now, it's because it's what's supposed to be. Do you mm -hmm. understand? Like Afrobeat is not Nigerian. Yeah. Do you know? Yeah. But a whole lot of people, when they think Afrobeat, yeah. they think they think Nigerian. I Afrobeat is like you know a, a collection of sounds across africa yeah yeah it could be the congolese guitar yeah. the south african yeah. whatever do you understand yeah. so yeah because it's like when people talk about afro beats now everyone just talks about fella yeah like everything yeah. is fella fella yeah. and i'm not saying it's not that but i'm no, saying there's not. so many different layers to yeah. it yeah so okay that's interesting so let's let's talk about your beginning your journey the first mm -hmm. ever moment of which you became or we started to know you in the industry mm -hmm. so talk us tell us through the start of your journey where did it really start for you oh i it started from um from uni days yeah i i was the number one music producer in my school so you used to produce from when you were yeah, like, yeah yeah for what like the little artist yeah in your you know <laughs> <laughs> little jimmy like and then i'll have like you know, people around me, girls in my room, Dang. the producers, you know, the I, 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 knew, I knew girls was going to slide somewhere in there. So, yeah, I have girls in my room. Yeah. You know. I actually have two of my friends to do the tag, it's Chris B, the drummer boy. One oh, did, really? yeah, one did the laughter and the other one did the, oh, it's Chris B, the drummer boy. You know, I've, <laughs> I've had that since uni day. So, oh, wow. I uh, started making music then and after school, mm -hmm. I was, I was, you know, making mm -hmm. a lot of money as at then you mm -hmm. know that i could say okay you know what let me just continue doing this here but i felt like I w I've, I've already done everything i needed to do in yeah. that part of you know nigeria i need to move to where the thing where things are going on where yeah. i have all the artists and stuff right. which is lagos so i moved to lagos and i had to start from scratch again you know because coming from where you've been getting yeah, the bread and yeah. come to where no one even knows Nosey. if you have a bakery right yeah yeah <laughs> do you understand yeah. so i i started like from scratch and i started posting stuff you know that's how i got to meet techno yes you know we're gonna so, get yeah. To that. yeah so yeah from there our first job is so would you say it was pana that got you noticed or where people started to really know your name? Or you do you know, think it was before that? I think I think it was Pana, to be honest. You think so? Yeah. 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 That, and was what? Like, that was like the first thing I did. And then everybody yeah. started saying, oh, yeah. who's this? Yeah. Who's this? Because yeah. yeah. I think when that came out, that was just, it was fresh. Yeah, that was, was when you noticed me. In it. Who, me? Yeah. Eh? Eh? Was it? Eh? Yeah. <laughs> or was no, it? I'm <laughs> yeah. <laughs> do you know what no because i didn't even know it was you behind it but let me tell you what i thought when it first came out it was fresh it mm -hmm. was different mm -hmm. and it didn't sound the same as yeah. anything yeah. that we had it didn't have that like yeah that's, that's, that's the that's the um no. that's the genre i'm known for i brought that to the industry and since 2016 till date people have been you know recycling yeah it i heard and you said stuff. that people yeah. are like yeah. trying yeah. to copy your yeah. little stuff i, heard no, I mean it's, yeah. it's 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 cool you know i i um, um fella didn't create the afro beat for for just fella yeah. he yeah. created Did it for, it for everyone everybody, so, yeah. so you just like you the center yeah that's up. why they call me the king of new wave man are you, yes, are you, we was gonna you? get to this <laughs> new wave thing that you say like oh, I'm the king of new wave because people you set the wave for yeah, people to for then people follow. To ride on, yeah, yeah, because when it yeah, so when it came out, I literally was like, yeah, this is this is fresh and like because it was so different to what we had all heard before mm -hmm. you just really wanted to dance to it yeah. and you see like in the video how he's all just like you're just like yes, <laughs> this is this is how it's supposed to be like yeah. this sounds like everybody could just follow mm -hmm. this and it would like make more sense than yes. the typical sound that yes. we're always hearing. Because now, I'm, I personally feel like now, things are starting to sound a bit the same yeah, again. Yeah, yeah. That, that bass, I don't know what it is, there's this particular sound, yeah, it's like, da -da 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 -da. and it's like, it's the same all mm -hmm, the time. Mm -hmm. So talk us through the process of making Pana and like what your thinking process was behind it yeah. when you did it. I think um, as at then I was, I was 
happy, you know. I like to We're happy, happy in life. Yeah, I was happy in life. I was happy with everything, everyone around me. You know, hey, I like to enjoyment. keep. <laughs> <laughs> it was, you know, that's season. being happy has nothing to do with what you're doing. Yes, yeah. it's, it's a decision that you you know you yeah, make on yourself. Mindset. You get so. Mm-hmm. I was happy. I you know was in a good relationship. Was in a good space with my mom. You know, everybody, my friends, they were all doing <laughs> good. Was sweet. So yeah. <laughs> Yeah. And I was making the beat for someone for free, you know. And they didn't. I've heard and this. Yeah, yeah they so didn't jump on it. I was it. making it for free for someone. Mm-hmm. And he said he didn't like it. Someone everybody knows. So, but I'm yeah, but you're not yeah, saying who no, it I is. I won't say. Have they? Oh, I might say behind the scenes. Yeah, yeah, you yeah. Can yeah. Do that. Let me know because I really, because <laughs> I really wanted. To, so, did that? Has that person ever contacted you? No, I did. I called the person again yeah. to tell the person. Oh, you see this beat? You said you didn't like. See. It's a number one song right now. Oh. It was like, no, that's not the beat. You changed it. And I'm like, of course okay. they would yeah. say that. Because that, that's the massive And the L. thing is, the person might have done it and would still have, you get a normal song. It would have been like every other person's song. So there's there's such a thing as destiny. Yeah, of course. As destiny. Hey, <laughs> destiny in the building. <laughs> but so what, do you think it would have, but do you think it would have still had the same effect if that other person would have done it? Or was, yes. it, was it just for techno? Was it yes. his... It will. He might have, you know. Who is this person? Because well, the, person the is. thing is, even Techno didn't want to drop the song. Oh, yeah. Because really? we've done. We he dropped a particular project before that one, and we've had this one. Do you understand? Yeah. So he was he was on tour, and he called me like, "Yo, do you think I should drop this song?" And I'm like, "Yeah." I didn't. I didn't think it was going to be massive. Yeah. I just felt okay. It was a good song, and everybody would like it yeah. you know you've it's something new you've not done something like this before you get me so mm-hmm. let's do it you get so he said yeah. you know what i'll drop the or just the audio and if the song is not moving we'll yeah. move on to another song do yeah. you understand so he dropped the audio and the audio blew up in less than a week wow yeah. look at that that's god look at yeah. god when yeah. he do it yeah. so would you so you were surprised by the success of it or did you know yeah, that at now? first at first i was telling yeah. him you see i told you you see i told you and then i'm like okay i didn't know this one yeah <laughs> you get me so yeah that is I was amazing surprised. all right we're gonna take a little music break yes. and then we're gonna get back into more questions i have so many more questions for you and i know you do and <laughs> you know i do <laughs> so we're gonna get into some music and lock in after this guys remember it's your girl christina come now this is tgm radio uk simply good music we are back so you are locked back into the carmel show and we got chris beats in the building yes woo, 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 woo. now remember if you want to stream you can stream live via the website at www.tgmradiouk.com or via social media which is all tgm and you can find me on social media at christina carmel and chris uh, I'm gonna try to remember. <laughs> Chris <laughs> Beats Chris underscore. Beats. It's underscore. Yeah. On all social medias. Yes. Right. Okay. Cool. So we just played a bit of Panna by mm-hmm. Techno. Mm-hmm. So how long does it actually take you to create a track? Um, as long as I'm in the mood for. Sometimes you know it takes me days. Sometimes. It depends on who I'm working with, basically. And what's your thinking process? to get into the zone to create oh so many things you do what do you do tell what's your like okay give us your lord have mercy <laughs> ah. okay give us your like top five rituals that you'll do to get yourself in the zone to work okay i'll make sure i'm not having an argument with anybody okay so good energy yeah bad energy so yeah. far, right? and food okay i'm good and <laughs> what? You, you know <laughs> <laughs> I was like yes yes yeah. <laughs> you know sometimes uh you know maybe a good <laughs> the thing is do you know when i said it <laughs> when i said maybe it a good I, knew, day, day, day. <laughs> I knew that's what it was <laughs> but you can't be doing that all the time while to be creating good music so it's like no, you said list five things. That, so, so this is yeah. what you always do? No, oh, this sometimes. is sometimes okay. you get. Yeah, okay. so yeah. Anything else? <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Anything else? Yeah, yeah, I don't think we have up to five things we do. Okay, it's just so one just thing, but all these ones, we're just trying to make sure I say things balance. <laughs> <laughs> 
<laughs> okay, so do you have like certain artists in mind when you create like music? Like, oh yes, all the yes, time. Yes, I always do. Really? Do you except, ever like? Except I'm making it for myself. Then I feel like because I have some beats that nobody will probably listen to till the end of days. <laughs> <laughs> so what do you do with them? I just I just listen to them on my own. I never play for you because. Anytime I play those beats for someone, the, uh, like the body language skills and bon- and skills and sakode, how do you say? Mm. I had those type. That that one was for me. Yeah. You know, so I didn't want nobody to record on that, and they did, and it was a smash. But I have beats like that that I like to keep to myself. And you have no plans for no, them? No. No. Never, ever, ever. No, 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 no. Maybe you come to the studio, I might play for them. I might yeah. play like one or two for you. Yeah. So, but I never let it out. Okay. And I also saw that on YouTube, you create like little videos yeah. of how you create beats and stuff. Yeah, yeah, yeah. So are you ever planning to do like a school to teach people how oh, to Oh, like in Nigeria, I have an produce. academy. Oh, do you? Yeah, Already? Do. Yeah. And how do people get into that? How can people get into that? Uh, from, uh, from, okay, let me start from the reason why I started yeah, doing yeah. online this thing. So we started, uh, when I s- made Pana, mm. a whole lot of people was, at, they were like on my case asking, okay, how do you do this? How do you do that? So I thought, you know what? I don't want to die with this knowledge I have. Yeah. So let me start sharing so i start i started sharing for free yeah you know telling you okay you could use this i re- i have a specific um email i always reply to you know m- just for producers basically okay um mentoring and showing them how to do stuff so it was getting too much that i had people from uh egypt from morocco oh, wow. from you know not i part of you know yes yeah, so. okay and I, we just thought it was, you know, best if we put together like an academy where people can study for like weeks and, you know, that's it. And I'm not the only one coaching. We'll have different big producers. Yeah. yeah. Oh, wow. That's really, really good. Yeah. I'm a businessman. I'm a boy. Hey. Okay. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> okay. So what, so what advice would you give to people like who want to be producers and who want to get into the whole music? Oh, yeah, don't yeah. listen to anybody. Just listen to your instinct. Yeah. Yeah. But do you find do you find it hard as a producer to always be... Well, not now, I would say, because maybe now you're more of an artist, but before being just a producer, did you find it hard just to be in the back of other people's... Well, I, I... From scratch, I wanted to be a producer. And yeah. I wanted to be a celebrity producer. I okay. don't. I don't like... Because I've seen the way, you know, producers just, you know, they make one, they make like a couple of hit songs and... Yeah. yeah do you understand? Yeah, 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 yeah. And then you see the artist for years and years and years, yeah, you know. It was yeah, only yeah. right for you to like um, strategize it right, you know. Yeah. I'm a music producer. It doesn't stop me from doing what I love, you know, bringing people together, making sounds that, sounds that they would probably not do on their own. Mm-hmm. Do you understand? So, yeah. So is that why you've now become more of an artist? Yeah, more of a celebrity producer. <laughs> but, <laughs> yeah, but more of an artist. Because now, do- now you're now you now doing music. Yes, yes, yes. yes you yes, are. Yes, yes, So definitely. which one do you prefer? Being the artist or being well, the producer? I, I'm a DJ as well. You I was know. just going to say that. Okay, so... Yeah, I was just... Listen, I, I know, I know. So, um, I like being a producer, to be honest. But mm-hmm. I like... Yeah, I like being a... Pro- I like the process. I like how I create music. If you were to sit in a room and I'm making music, you might propose to me. You never know. Uh, <laughs> you got Bars. <laughs> bars. <laughs> Okay, so (laughs) right, you throw me off. Okay, um, so um, (laughs) why have you now decided to do music and become an artist as opposed to just being? Oh, I said I said it earlier because you know the music producers just go like this. So you want to be bigger than just that? I want to I want to like break the barrier between being an artist Mm -hmm. and a producer, you know, if that's what you want. You know, I have some friends who 
they are music producers, but they never want to get That's what they want in front to of the camera and yeah. do anything. But me, yeah. I'm all about the camera and stuff. That's what I was going to say, because yeah. that's what I was asking, because I, I feel like you're more suited to be... Yeah. You can hold it. You yeah. can yeah. hack being yeah. out there, yeah. whereas a lot of people yeah. can't do She's that. She's been saying it. Yeah. yeah, you've got the... Yeah, yeah you've got the... Because a lot of people just want to be in the back, yeah. and they just want to be quiet. Yeah. And, I, I'm, but you're very... You know, like, uh, I, I told someone, I told someone on, you know, a radio that you can't... You can't look this fly and, you know, be behind the camera. You know what I mean? So It's true. It's yeah. true. Fly don't you boy. think so? Do you think? No, I agree. Yeah. 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 I think if so. you've got it. Don't you think it. so, bro? Oh, you, want, you, want, <laughs> <laughs> you want everyone to say yes. <laughs> no, I agree. If you've got it, why not? Because otherwise it's just wasted talent. Yeah. You know. So then why? So then why? How long have you been doing DJ for? Um, As long as I've been producing for. Really? Yeah. So do you do like so you're doing like everything? You yeah, do um, everything. I do, I do, I do um, East African tour where I go around East Africa. You know, wow. DJ schools. You know, I have yeah. Oh wow, really? Yeah. Yeah. You trying to do it all? Take you over know, the game? Get the money. <laughs> <laughs> Secure the bag. <laughs> all right. So what? Okay. So I'm gonna ask a question. So who is, who has been the easiest and the hardest artist to work with? easiest yeah easiest easiest would be techno because you know sometimes i don't have to record him i just sit and you know say let's do this let's do that do you get because yeah. he's a producer himself yeah you get so we just we just come we just come up with ideas together you know mm. sometimes i'm doing it in my studio or while at his or he's at mine yeah. you know so uh it's like it is it doesn't feel like work it's like you know playing but that's also because you two have like a good relationship as well and yeah i have so a good it, relationship so with a whole lot of people yeah you know i feel like anybody i'm working with feels like oh chris beat is my producer but i'm there i'm like jesus for the whole world <laughs> 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 you're just giving and giving <laughs> so then who's been the hardest and be honest uh, come on now i don't know do you know rugged man no yeah that's yeah, the hardest so, person yeah. to work with yeah why but I would say rugged man and who else? You know, if we have to do like a song, yeah, and we have like five, six versions, you know, that's then that's that yeah, says a lot, isn't yeah, it? yeah. So yeah, rugged man is like that. Um, Ron Town is like that. Oh really? Yeah. But is it not because they're just like perfectionists? Yeah, or, yeah. That's, and it that's, makes that's, it hard. Yeah, it make it makes sense. Do you yeah. get me? But you know, Ron Town, I, I understand. Do you understand? Because you know he he's a producer as well yes. so he, he has a way he does his stuff but uh rugged man wants to take out like he's such a perfectionist yeah he wants to take out even the slightest ease you know maybe <laughs> maybe i say give me this give me that mm. yeah. you get so yeah. the it's like it's like you hitting the snare yeah so yeah. give me this give me that yeah. mm. You get yeah, so he yeah. wants to, you know, let's take out that beat, and it sounds good because there's a bounce to it. But he wants to take it out. So yeah, people like that. Do you ever just say like, so do you ever get into conflict and just be like, no, but it sounds better this way? Yeah, I do. And then what do they yeah, say? They just I do. No, we go, they go and they come back and they be like, oh, I think he actually sounds good this way. <laughs> <laughs> Stress. <laughs> that must be so <laughs> stressful. That yeah. must actually be so stressful. Yeah. Okay, so we're going to take a little break because I want to I wanna talk about you as an artist and some of the music and your mm -hmm. new singles that's coming out now. Yeah. So we're going to do that a little bit after. So we're going to play some music first yeah. and we're going to talk a little bit after. So make sure you guys continue. To if you want to stream us, you could do that via the website at www.tgemradiouk.com or you can find me on social media at Christina Carmel and Chris. Chris Beats underscore. All right, so I just got a message to ask you to say, are you single? Um, yes, and you know, I was single up to like a few hours ago. Eh? What does that, <laughs> what does that mean? Yeah, I, I wasn't single up to like a few hours ago. So are you what, why you dumped someone? Someone dumped you? What's going on? No, I got, someone dumped me. Oh no! Yeah, but this this same person dumped me like you know. 50, like 58 million times. <laughs> so, <laughs> so basically, it means you're going to go back. So no, it's just temporary. So who knows? But this it's time is, is a bit serious. So, you know, uh, I messed up. Oh, I messed did you? Up. What did you do? Yeah. I messed up. 
pads. No, just drop this thing. Yeah, so let's just <laughs> 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 let's just be moving on. Yeah. <laughs> oh no, I actually wouldn't know now. Like, yeah, tell me after. Tell me after. Yeah, I, I can know tell you me. after. <laughs> so, who are if you could work with anyone within mm-hmm. yeah. West Africa? Mm-hmm. and anyone internationally mm-hmm. who would it be let's do three three okay. so three three in west africa west okay yeah who would it be yo you know in west i've worked with almost everybody really yeah anyone you haven't that is on your asha do you know asha what is it s-a no s i mean a-s-a no but it sounds... oh yeah she does like um african jazz okay yeah. okay that would yeah. be dope yeah 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 we've not done anything together okay yeah other than that i've worked with ev- almost everybody yeah that yeah. is true <laughs> yeah <laughs> okay so internationally oh yeah i want i want i would like to have something with um j cole i'd yes. like to have something with um beyonce oh yeah um dua lipa yeah and you know a whole lot you know. wow yeah soon i mm-hmm. feel it yeah spirit. i know i know it's I coming know. it's something coming. is coming with it's um, coming you know it's coming i can tell i can tell too so I we'll be tell. here yeah. do we have this on tape as well yes we'll be here i want you to record it we'll be here to talk about how you know you know maybe not here but we'll yes. definitely talk about yeah. it <laughs> yeah yeah it's coming so, yeah, it's coming, it's coming. It's coming. Yeah. so we've prophesied it it's in the end yeah. put it in the that's universe true. it will happen yeah. amen yeah. Sure. amen let somebody amen. say amen. Amen. amen hallelujah, hallelujah. <laughs> 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 so tell us a little bit okay because we haven't played it yet but obviously we're gonna play your new single yeah. so tell us a little bit about your new single oh it's co- the song is called heat it's yeah. a heat featuring um techno and tenny and is my first time working with tenny actually so oh, yeah uh, Love tenny, yeah oh. oh her voice is just <gasps> again another refreshing voice to yeah. the scene we, yeah we, we needed that and i feel like i feel like you guys haven't even seen anything we have a yeah. song that we did together that we really? is not um out do you understand it's her song yeah it's that song is going to like She's shut amazing. down the whole like scene yeah. again you know what i mean <laughs> <laughs> yeah <laughs> real <Re-over. laughs> yeah. yeah so yeah She's an amazing person. And techno, you know, techno always comes hard you and Anything. techno yeah. the two, the <laughs> yeah, two, the yeah. two pair. so it's 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 sick the song is sick and yeah. the video is coming out in less than in I, no time yeah I, but it done? yeah it's done already oh wow mm-hmm. we can't wait for that guys you need to make sure that you check that out i'll yeah. be definitely waiting for that so what can we then expect for i'm not even gonna say it's 2020 because yeah 2019 is finished now oh no 20, 2019 is still very much around we've got like how long yeah well t- actually no because you might have things yeah um my birthday is in december oh yeah my birthday is in november yeah. too oh, oh yeah <laughs> so we yeah oh when is it in december 25th on christmas day oh it's christmas day yeah it's always boring it's really so, it's always boring that would Don't, be lit like though, yo no because no, everybody's about jesus not you hey <laughs> 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 you get <laughs> but would you would you would you but then i suppose i, t- it's I, a told, double I, celebration, I told i told though. my mom you'd have just you know try to like keep it <laughs> keep you in there you know? <laughs> keep you in there till couple you know? more hours because she 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 has a story that you stayed from I, like I, I was i was due for the 6th of february yeah but i came 25th of february you can imagine i want I wa- maybe i was just there getting some extra knowledge yeah <laughs> you understand yeah. but yeah it happened oh wow yeah. okay so yeah so what can we expect yeah um I'm, i have i have an album coming out it's called african time mm-hmm. you know how the whole world is talking about africa right now just yes. like you said earlier everybody yeah. wants to you know be africa whether everybody no matter who to. you are you yeah, and now yeah. yeah so yeah. <laughs> so now um i'm trying to like tell people that this is african's time it's time for us to own it to know that yeah so that's what the album is about and i have a whole lot of artists on it there's whiskey on it there's davido on it there's tenny on Mm -hmm. it there's techno there's diamond platinums Mm -hmm. there's um ug from your place and you know there's a whole lot so and uh, there's tempo on it there's c-boy on it those are artists i have under my label and yeah 
Oh, wow. So, yeah. It's all coming. Yeah. It's, it's all, all coming. coming. It's all coming. So, have you got any, like, shows or anything? That yeah, I'm playing uh, at the, this thing. Uh, first time. It will be my first time in Ghana, actually. Yeah, so. When is it? I say in November or December, I think. But I'll check. November, oh. yeah? Yeah, Afro Nation. Hey, yeah. I'll see you there, yeah. my friend. Yes. Yes. <laughs> yes. Welcome. Come yeah. to my country. Yes. Yeah. That will be so much fun. Yeah. Literally, everybody's going. Yes. That is going to be. Yeah. Well, you're going to Nigeria after yes, that? No, she, I actually, yeah, you, yeah, actually you said only, you, yeah, yeah, you said it's only you 45 wanted, minutes, yeah, isn't it? Yeah. Oh, you yeah. like, I'll make him I'm getting all excited <laughs> now. No, literally, plan I will come. <laughs> it will be plan A. <laughs> <laughs> we will all, no, literally, I'm so excited. Yeah, we should do that, yeah, definitely. Yeah. Oh, wow. So we've got a lot to look forward to. Yes, yes. Definitely. All right, so we're going to play the hit. Yeah. yeah? Yes. But tell the people where they can find you, where they can hit you up. Oh, that's Chris Beats. That's K R I Z B A T Z underscore everywhere. You know. So wait, hold on. So if people like, do people send like some of your fans? Do they like send you like tracks and stuff? Yes, they always do. Have you ever? Has anyone ever sent you something that was like super dope? Yes, they uh, always do. And then what do you do with it? The thing is, say, I yeah, try yeah. to. I, when when you want to send me a song, I, mm. if we're having a conversation, not just you, not that you just see, just send me a link. I would never click it. Yeah. You know, so we must <laughs> <laughs> we must have said something yeah. about it. Do you understand? So, and I would tell you, don't send me a song you've not released because I'm a viber. I okay. don't want to be in the studio and be doing something and yeah. maybe zenge. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> goes to my head and yeah. you know i just want to and it's someone's song mm. you get so i don't like that i like when i know your song is released i'm not listening to keep anything here do you understand so yeah okay so can people like send you stuff yes like, definitely. You, do you, have, do you, you don't do music do you no okay no because people usually me. ask if they could send you stuff if they do music so i'm are wondering they, maybe you or are you thinking of me one. to do yeah, music yeah no, like, well, people do send me stuff, but then no, they will it's send like, you. Uh, they will send of you course, stuff. the moment they realize you're on radio, they <laughs> want to send you things. But yeah. it's like, yeah, send it to people like you, mm, like okay, yeah, who yeah, can yeah. do something with yeah. it or make it yeah. great. And yeah. not yeah. to say don't send me stuff, guys. I do look at it. So yeah, I mean, if you like it, you play. It. You know, and I will try, and, but yeah. it's more to send it to like artists and producers who can yeah. actually do yeah, something do with something. it. And yeah. and it's good to know that you're still like trying to help. Other yes, people definitely. Come up. Definitely, do you know what I mean? Definitely. We're not just sitting mm-hmm. on your no, throne. No. Which is really good, actually. Yeah, it's, it's good boring a lot of to sit do that. on the throne alone. Amen. Yeah, so you need to sit with people. And the king always the needs king, the queen, yes. like they yeah. say. So. Yay! But no. No. Wow. <laughs> I'm joking. I'm joking. Nah, wow. <laughs> I'm joking. Anyway, <laughs> <laughs> moving on. <laughs> anyway, <laughs> bars. <laughs> <laughs> anyway so guys we're coming towards the end of the show guys mm-hmm. it has been so much fun to have all of you in here yeah, every single everybody. one of you every yeah. s- it's been so much fun guys yeah thank you so much thank for coming so much to for bless me all us. with your presence thank you. i thank love you. it it's been great energy thank you so we're gonna play we're gonna end the show with your hit hit yeah, yeah. Is there anything you want to say? Anybody you want to? Yeah, um, hit is out, ladies and gentlemen. Go get it. It's available on all platforms. You know, you can just hit H I T Chris Beats. You mm-hmm. know, so yeah, everyone. Have you Shout given it. a date for the video yet or no? No, no, but we'll decide on that maybe tonight or something. Yay, yeah, so shout out to nice. everybody, shout out to Tia, shout out to Lynn, shout out to Temple, shout out to Chris Beat, shout out to you, shout out to my bro, shout out to my bro. Hey. Uh, shout, shout out to Nigeria, Nigeria, shout out Nigeria, shout out shout out to my mom most especially and yeah that's thank you <laughs> <laughs> all right guys it's your girl christina Kama. it's been so much fun having these guys here remember you can find me every wednesday seven to nine giving you all the oh i've even look i've had so much fun i forgot to give you like the tea of the week the gossip of the week we, I'm just going to do it quickly. Basically, word on the street is that Adele is dating Skepta. I don't know what is going on here. It's literally hello from the other side, for real. Because that is a pair that ain't nobody saw coming. But I'll talk about it more on social media, so you know I'll have my opinions on that. Thanks for locking in, guys. And stay locked. This is Chris Beats with... It's Chris with the drama, guys.